to y'all. I'm visiting um, what I like to call my functional movement specialist, Scott Levinson. He is the one who really helped me with my rehab when I was coming back from my injury. Um, and we're just doing a little tune-up to make sure everything's right and on track, especially as the outdoor season is getting started. Gliding very well. It's going to change sort of the insertion point and the activation principle of the hamstring a little bit. So <clears throat> to me, it's really a matter of cleaning these things up, but then regularly cleaning them up, and staying on top of that, making sure that foot moves well. things. One is it's going to work on that, but two, you can use that as a little bit of a red flag for it's not working because if you go to do it and you're, you just can't get your toe on the ground, you know you're out of line. Okay, so I just finished seeing Scott. I like to just see him to just tune up and to make sure that my body is aligned, my body is functioning well, my body is moving efficiently. I think one of the biggest things that I learned from Scott is prevention, catching things before they become an issue, and putting exercises into your everyday, your pre-workout, post-workout recovery to be signals to you so that you know like, hey, I need to get treatment or I need to get something like that. Because the reality of the situation is training causes breakdown, training causes tightness. Um, so the recovery work that you're gonna do after a workout is making sure you give yourself that amount of space so that you know, you're know you keeping yourself far enough from that big injury or that big incident that might potentially happen. Um, I think before I had my really big injury, I used to you know, finish practice and just be like, deuces, I'm out. Um, but now there's a, there's a whole level of recovery work that I do to basically reset my body um, after practice. So once I've kind of put stress on it, for training, I want to get it to reset and bring it back to where I was so when I train for the next day, I can be in a better place. Another thing that I really learned from Scott was, you know, doing exercises with intention. It's not a matter of just doing an exercise just to do it for the mere sake of doing it, but doing it correctly and doing it um, so that your body is in the proper position. A huge thank you to Premier Performance, um, to Scott Livingston. Um, I'm so appreciative. Like, this is the thing. You guys see us on the track for that very small amount of time, um, but you don't see the team and the amount of work that goes into, you know, the prep and the work. So I'm so appreciative to my whole team and everybody who, you know, supports me and keeps me good. Injury prevention is a huge part of, you know, what we do. And you can be in the best shape of your life, but if you're not, you know, healthy, it doesn't matter. Like, you, you gotta be able to get to the line healthy. So prevention, Recovery work, post practice, um, having a good warm up, um, and really great body awareness. It's about training smart and it's about training efficient. Love it.